Hi, it's Lou Brown. I'm back with another of my 101 cash flow accelerators to help you be more successful in your real estate business. In this section, we've been talking about renovations and boy, I tell you what, I've done a bunch of those. I've done whole subdivisions and it's been really interesting to learn about working with contractors and getting them to behave the way you want them to. Oh, behave, as Austin Powers would say. And they won't unless you penalize them. Well, in my contract, it's called Independent Contractor Services Agreement. It's available in volume 11 renovations under streetsmartinvestor.com. One of the things I have is a contract for the contractor. And an important thing to have in there is penalties when they don't complete on time. So typically we go through a list of things that need to be done. I provide that to them. It's a contractor. Uh, it's actually all the scope of works and it depends on which contractor I'm talking to, whether it, it is the general contractor or it's plumbing, heating and air conditioning, electrical, roofing, painting, carpentry, general, each one of those have their own scope of work and then attached to that scope of work is a terms and conditions or might call it rules of engagement. And one of the things that we will do before we start the renovation and before I pay them any money is we will enter into an independent contractor services agreement. In that agreement, we have agreed to a certain deadline, a certain date, that by all means the property will complete. Now, what happens is there's a penalty after that date. And so there's a daily penalty or a cost for them exceeding the deadline. Well, why is that? You have to understand you have expenses each and every day. You have your cost of funds, you have your insurance, and you have your property taxes, plus you have your opportunity cost. That house hasn't been sold if the contractor's delaying that project. It is an age old situation that people run into dealing with contractors. It's very important that you have a deadline in there and you have a penalty on a per day basis. I've built that into my in independent contractor services agreement. Hopefully that has been helpful to you. Like it, love it, share it, and I'll see you soon. Yeah, baby.